The secret to big success is being able to create and envision a future that no one else has. You see, if you want to do something that really changes the world, you must do something different. You must not just follow. See, in business, you can have an incremental business, which is where you just move the world forward a little bit, or you can have an exponential business where it completely changes the paradigm. Exponential businesses are where somebody creates a new idea. If you want results that other people uh, are unable to have, if you want to really create something different, you must learn to be intuitive. And this applies to your life as well. In your life, if you want to be remembered, if you want to do something that impacts people, there is no point just going across what other people have already done. You must break free from that mold and step into your creative power. The alchemists talked about this actually. They said that you can turn gold, a base metal, sorry, lead into gold. And, and they talked about a philosopher's stone, a stone that um, could never be held, a, had a fire that could never be put out. And, uh, and this would turn a base metal into gold. It would turn something non-precious into precious. And that thing is imagination. It's actually imagination, it's invention, it's intuition. Everything that we have in our world has been invented in the mind of a human. And, and that is actually your power. Your secret is the ability to tap into this imagination and imagine a future. Everything that you want to create, whether it's books or poetry or a new business or a new body, you must imagine, you must invent. Learning to harness your imagination is the key. Most of us are imagining the worst case scenarios and then trying to avoid them. See, we live in the present moment. And if you break the word present in half, it stands, it can read present. See, every moment is present. And then you live through it. It's present through your imagination. It's present from your mind. You have the ability to go into the unknown and make up, invent, and create a future that doesn't actually exist yet. This is our power. This is the secret. This is a, this is what you must learn to tap into. To do this, that you actually need to understand structure. The structure to pull in your imagination and to use it with precision is a creative structure. The creative structure is where you focus on what you would like, then you notice where you are now. The difference between those two points creates a discrepancy in the field. It creates a, a tension. And, and just like water will always flow downhill because of the tension or pressure placed on it by gravity, your mind will always cook up and find a way to close those two points. It always will. If you can hold the tension and leave the vacuum open, that vacuum is going to pull in ideas. And this is exactly what you must do. Those ideas will come through your superconscious mind to you. And you will be able to make a future that has never been experienced before. If you want to create big success, you must learn what all of the great creators, whether it's the business leaders, the authors, the musicians, the artists, the politicians, the educators, the healers, the big creators that have existed, they have always been able to tap into the superconscious field, use the creative structure, and invent new realities. And you can as well. It is the soul secret fire. It is the Philosopher's Stone, and it is your secret. It is how to use alchemy.